Hello everyone, this is Aida Qolami from Agrimet Stock Research Company and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to subtract time in Excel. So as you can see here, I have two categories for explaining this question for you. So the first one is when your time difference is less than 24 hours. So they are both happening in one 24 hours. And the second one, is that when these two times a difference is more than 24 hours so they are definitely happening in two or more uh, days so for the first time if you want to subtract two times which are less than 24 hours different what you will do so let's say I have the first time as um, six 30 of course a.m. and you can see that if I double click on that it's a.m. is shown and then the next time I have is 10 45 p.m. so you can see that it automatic automatically uh, converts to um, you know the same format so it's 6 30 and it's 22 45 p.m. so 10 p.m. I wrote and it became like this what I want to do here is that I want to put an equal mark simply select the second time and put a minus and then select the first time click enter and you can see here the difference is shown um, some problems that may occur in here is that maybe you have to if, if you had in the result if you had 1650 like p.m. or or yeah, I'm sorry if you had 415 PM what you will do is that right click on that go to format cells and here select this one so in custom um, segment if it's on uh, hours um, moments and seconds and then AM PM which it will show you like this you should change the format to our moments click OK so then if you're um, subtracting two times which are more than 24 hours what I mean by that is that you have let's say um, the 9 uh, ninth date of um, tenth month of 2019 and in the hour let's say 6 30 um, a.m. and in the same tenth month and eleventh day in 2019 um 22 or yeah let's say 10 45 p.m so these formats are now different um so it, it should not be on dates uh it should be on custom and here on uh yeah let's find it together month day year hours minutes so what i want to add here is hours minutes and then um am or pm so i click ok and you can see that this format is applied right click on this so what what you should do is to select both of them right click and go to format cells custom and select it so months days years 
hours, um, minutes, and then a.m., p.m. So I click OK, and you can see they are both converted to the um, to the format. So what I want to do is to again take the second time. So it's in the date 11, it's the second time. And then put a minus mark, select the first time and click OK. So here it's showing you the days. So if you want to have the hours, you know, um, you, you want to have the hours, you should um, multiply it to 24. So you can see that it's 64 hours hours between these two events and if you want to don't have this uh, you know uh, the decimal the, uh, the decimals uh, after 64 you can simply um, decrease decimals so it's 64 hours so I guess that's it for today's video. I hope you learned something new. Please don't forget to give this video a thumb up and subscribe to Agreement Self channel. I will see you in the next video and bye.